have a man kid. can have a kid. How? Transgender. Your gender changes. Oh, pause. You can have a kid. Google. Get out of my face. I'm not a transgender. I'm a bitch. You said that. Why, how's my phone about it? How's my phone about it? What's your problem? What's your problem? Sandwich. Who's gonna tell her, boys? Who's gonna tell her? She's really trying to justify what is physically impossible. She actually tried using Google as an answer. Then she locks herself in the bathroom, talking about her friends have got their feelings hurt. I think we can clearly see who's got their feelings hurt by this bullshit. I don't even know why these people are even acknowledging and entertaining that. Someone in the comments said she kind of looked like Zoe from the Proud Family. she is beautiful once and she won't believe you but if you tell a girl she's fat she will always remember it that's because elephants never forget <laughs> why do you not like nursery because the girls talk too much and uh when they don't eat salt they talk okay what about the boys we we do it when we need to talk okay do they talk too much yeah i like this one when a new video game comes out, call in sick and play it all day. Be a man. <laughs> That's what I do. Man, right, you built like the Kool-Aid man. Don't start that. You built like Shamar. Don't start that. You don't cook out your motherfucking You about 50 with years old with some shredded jeans on. We even. You wearing two years ago Dior's. We even. Go ahead, Woody. They two Get years your uncle old? under control. I ain't know they were two years old. I just bought them. Refocus on me. Come on. Refocus your eyes on me. Come on, look me. It ain't hard right to here. miss you, big as you is. 60-40 vision. Get with me right now. It ain't here. hard to miss you. Get with me. Come on. Yeah, man. You, I see me. you. Okay. Big as you. Yeah. I see you. can't miss you. With I know no I. like a lot of girls that look like your daughter. Go ahead. Next question. Hey, a lot of girls say honesty is the best policy, and he was definitely that. If women are looking for financially secure men, what in exchange would be of equal value to a man? There's probably three big primary things from the Christian perspective that we would want. I think that men essentially want peace in their home. This is a big one that people forget about all the time. The best way you can show a man respect is to understand and anticipate the things that he wants before he even knows that he wants them. And the way that that shows respect and the way that that shows that you love him is because if you can anticipate those things, he knows that you're paying attention to him very closely. So you're the focus. And then the third thing is you have to put him above your own needs and your own desires. And number three is the thing that I think women, at least in modernity, fail out the most. Women are trained from birth now how they deserve to be treated. And men are trained from birth how they're supposed to treat women. But nobody is trained from birth for how they're supposed to treat men. Well put, Andrew. Well put. Yeah, Andrew's completely right. And and peace at home costs nothing, but it means everything. People say loyalty, honesty, and respect is the only requirements. I think that's the bare minimum. And that's why a lot of the passport bros are going abroad because in the West, girls aren't really raised with that mentality anymore. My wife told me to stop being an idiot and just be myself. I told her to make up her mind. Well, my wife is blaming me for ruining her birthday. That's ridiculous. I didn't even know it was her birthday. I like nice guys. I like someone who's really sweet to me, who I can have a nice... I'm, I would love a nice best friend for life. Yeah, lovely meeting you, yeah? <laughs> oh, nah. Call the next one, yeah? Bye! See you when I see you. Goodbye! I know guys love to be the new bitches and they don't want to chase, but you have to chase. Don't mind chase you? Uh, I don't really answer DMs. I don't give them the chance. Okay, but you want them to chase you, but you're not going to answer them. Yeah, keep going. One day I will. One day you will? Yeah, okay. when you're deserving. Oh, okay. Make it make sense, guys. Some of the egos on the scales is just out of this world, isn't it? Someone in the comments said, her DMs are as empty as her plate after a meal. 
You're gonna see right now. Uh, what happened now? Watch. What happened? Shut up. Hello. Yo, kid, it's Chelsea. Yo, what's up? Hey, is Cook over there? He hasn't come home last night. He told me he was gonna go hang out with you last night. Um, yeah, yeah. He he in the couch sleeping right now. Oh, okay, so he's all right? Yeah, he probably just like still hung over from yesterday. We were lit. Uh, you really want me to wake him up? Yeah, I really need because the dog's out of food. Nah. Mm. All right, all right, give, give you one sec, one sec. Hey, hey, cut, man, yo, yo, girl on the phone. Yo, she on the phone, cut. Hey, baby, what's up? Baby? Yeah. You all right, honey? Yeah, I'm good. I'm just, I'm just still, I'm hung over. I'm sleeping right now. Okay, baby, don't forget to buy the dog food before you come home. I think from that phone call, he's not a friend, he's a brother. He's a real one, they don't make him like this anymore. We need to give that guy an Oscar. That, that was well played right there. What's your biggest toxic trait? I like to ghost people and then pop up, pop back up in their life. She belongs to the streets. You're the man that your bloodline has been waiting for. Do you have what it takes? You have to believe. You have to have faith. Does your last name mean something to you? If not, you're born to lose. Stay woke in these streets, lad. I'm at the pizza hut. I'm at the taco bar. I'm at the car and shoot me for a hand back over. I'm not a scientist, but lad, I'd go and check on this. Yeah, I'm not too sure about this one, boys. Someone is telling Porky's here. And he's really believing it, and she uploaded this video to social media to make him look even more stupid. What's her name? Fatima. And Blake. You got a pound of grass and a pound of weed. Which one is heavier? A they're the can same of weight. No, they're a pound and a pound the same weight. True. Sure. A pound you gonna be a follower? You gonna be a follower your whole life? Give me the question. <laughs> so you got a pound of grass and a pound of weed. Which one is heavier? Yeah, they're the same, I think. You stupid. You ignorant or you just plain old deaf? Why is it hard dating nowadays? Why is it hard dating nowadays? Are you married? It's only hard dating nowadays if you're clapped and ugly and you have nothing to prove and you have nothing to give. For me, dating is easy. So you got girls? Yeah. Okay, are you married? No. Okay, so what kind of girls do you go for then? Educated girls. Where'd you find them? Everywhere. Look, tell me, where'd you find an educated woman? Find them everywhere. Such as? Um, what, you want me to name streets? I'm asking you where you find educated woman, isn't it? Like, where would you find a woman that's educated? Where would you find somebody? I mean, you're on a night out, right? So you look at the girl on a night out, but where would you find educated woman? Every, everywhere. Pretty sure this was just the alcohol speaking. I don't think this guy even knew what the interviewer was saying. And fair play to that interviewer, he showed next level patience right there because from the first question onwards, you could tell he was fed up, but he wanted to see it through. What are the signs that a woman's cheating for guys that don't know? She withdraws, holds back, spending so much time on her phone, she's yeah. cheating on you. So if a, if a lady replies to so if a lady replies to her man late, she's cheating on him. Hundred percent, without a doubt, always cheating. Wow, and you're better open about it. You heard it from me. Look at this video with me. What are we looking at? What's Okay. Okay. Mm. You like the video? Mm-hmm. Cool. What was the number on her shirt? Oh shit. Um. You mean Jersey? What was the number on her shirt? Uh, man, listen. I'm not gonna lie. I I don't even know. What was the number on her shirt, Blau? I, I, I don't know. I couldn't tell you. I honestly couldn't tell you. I didn't even know she was a number on it. Was it a number on it? You sure it was a number on her shirt? What was the number on the girl's shirt? I don't... Did you see a number? Because if you didn't see a number, I don't know if I saw a number. I'm trying to remember. What Damn, did was I see a number? the number on the girl's shirt? I don't, did you shit? Answer that question. Did you shit? Was you shit? What was the number on the shirt? Look guys, I'm going to be completely honest here. Watching this video for the first time as well, same as you guys, I didn't even see a number either. So, look mate, 
just take the L, same as me. Let me know in the comments, did you guys see a number without rewinding it? You have to let me know. We must stay focused, brothers. We must stay focused. No